Hi, my name is Austin Whitenauer. I'm a doctor of physical therapy, board certified specialist in orthopedic physical therapy, and, I was the, and I'm the clinical manager for the East Lake Mary location within Ability Rehabilitation. So these are difficult times, and a lot of us have found ourselves working from home now more than ever. And under these unusual circumstances, the stressors of a pandemic going on, the stressors that leaves with the uncertainty of our social situations, it, that can obviously put a burden, not just the fact that we're in our home office more often, but we're having less social interaction. So how can we create more resiliency within these difficult times? Well, I'm gonna present with you a series of movements and exercises that can break up the monotony of this office work that you're constantly doing from home. And let's see if at least physically you can keep yourself in a really good place. The next exercise is another convenient one because you can actually keep your desk in front of you and kind of use that as a little bit of a guide or even some help if you need a little bit of help with your balance as you do this. You'll stand with the desk in front of you. You're actually gonna take a step back, but really think of it more as getting that back foot out of the way because you want that front leg bearing most of the weight. Basically, you just keep your body as close to upright, you're allowed to lean forward, that's okay, that's okay, no harm in that. But really just trying to rely on that front leg to lower you down and then push you back up. Now the caveat to this is you don't have to go all the way to the floor, that's not completely necessary. So if you feel like for whatever reason you don't have that full control to get down and get back up, you could always just go partially down and build up to that later. Work on doing about five on each side, if that gets pretty easy, you can always build yourself up to 10 or possibly even 12 to 15 and just gradually working on the depth. If that gets easy, you could always add a little bit of weight to it as well.